Are you tired of getting cooked and destroyed every time you spawn despite being a heavily armed special forces unit? Well then, make sure to pay attention to the tips in this short video. First things first, be sure to spectate the SCPs and hostiles like LSD when you're on spectator. This is essential if you wanna know what you'll be facing and if you don't wanna get ambushed. Sticking together with your team is essential as power is in numbers, even if your team is retarded. Radios are a really powerful tool and can make your life easier if you use them properly by informing your team of the SCPs positions and status. When you're talking on the radio with someone who you don't recognize, make sure to ask him to say one of these squad names that they're on the latest one, because this can only be seen by foundation personnel. If your friend is dying due to an effect, don't be greedy and make sure to share your healing as there's plenty around to restock. Also, if you need additional ammo, make sure to check the local armories like the ones in checkpoint or the ones in heavy. You can also check your teammates' corpses for ammo and take it out of their guns by holding R. If you're dealing with an SCP-079, make sure to blow up in advance the doors that are often used to choke point you, especially if you have a few extra grenades that you can't carry. However, if you're facing a SCP-096, please stop running away like a little baby and follow him until his rage ends, and then proceed to gun him down. However, be cautious of any SCPs that are guarding him. Oh, also, if he has an SCP-173 teammate, there's no point in looking up or down. It won't help you, so all you can do is shoot. Don't close elevators on your teammates like an idiot because you're afraid. Also, make sure that the elevators are always at your ground level so you have an escape route. Speaking of elevators, if you're spawning and you know there's enemies capable of mass that near the gates, then you probably shouldn't enter the first elevator ride unless you wanna have an extremely high chance of dying. If you wanna find the light containment elevators or heavy checkpoints as fast as possible, make sure to stick to the edges of the map after leaving the gate. Always make sure that your guns are reloaded so you don't end up in an awkward situation. Flashlights are basically a must have if you're facing an SCP-079. Be aware of suspiciously closed doors and step to the side when opening them so you don't get absolutely obliterated in one second. Don't shoot past if they're harmless as when they escape or detained they give the same amount of respawn tickets as a scientist. So what's the conclusion? Don't be a pussy, stick with your team and share loot as there's plenty around, use your guns on the SCPs instead of randomly killing class D, and of course to subscribe in order to not miss out on any advanced guide videos and plenty of random cool SCPSL content. Every subscriber means one more educated SCPSL teammate for you that won't close the elevator in your face. Anyways, have a great day and I'll see you next time.